Yo, everybody, this is Rock with the Brain. Oh, aka the Toy Bookie. Let me redo that one. Yo, everybody, this is Rock with the Great, aka the Toy Bookie. And in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to make your own custom Halloween 3 Tom Atkins figure to go with your Halloween 3 uh, little trick or treaters. Perfect. I don't know about you guys, but trick or treat. You trick or treat. Yes, trick or treat. I do like that. But, um,. Halloween 3 is one of my favorite movies, not even just a Halloween movie or whatever. I just really like that type of sci-fi, like Night of the Comet Perfect. and uh, Night of the Creeps Perfect. and stuff like that. That's like a genre I really enjoy. So Halloween 3 is one of my favorite movies and I was, I totally forgot that they had the Night of the Comet figure, you know, with Tom Atkins. So I was like, oh, one day I'm gonna, I love Night of the Comet, uh, Night of the, uh, creeps, excuse me. I'm, I'm now I'm just getting everything kabobulated. I just filmed like five videos. Cut me some slack. Sorry guys. So um, I have this figure. I actually have two of him and I was doing a review of the Chevy Chase Chainsaw Clark and I realized he has the outfit that Tom wears in that movie or the closest that we'll get for what I have in my house. So Perfect. today we're going to be doing some stuff and I'm going to open him up and we're going to we're going to try to put a custom Tom Atkins figures to go with your Halloween 3 NECA toys shelf. So um, I have an extra Tom Atkins head. I actually have casts of this head. If anyone needs, because if anyone wants to copy this recipe, go right ahead. You could uh, contact me on Instagram at the toy bookie. I'll have a few heads casted unpainted. You paint it yourself. It should be easy. These retro figures are pretty big. Eight inches, it's easy to paint. So you paint one up yourself and you could, you know, maybe make your own Tom Atkins if you like Halloween 3 as much as I do. So uh, hit me on, you know, hit me up if you want a head. One thing you don't realize is this is like a $200 figure, $150 figure. It's insane. Uh, hopefully they re-release it, but it's a Shout Factory exclusive, so maybe they won't. I'm going to open this, take him out of the package, and let's get to work. I want to start seeing what works. If it works, let's get to it. Perfect. All right, so one of the cool things about this retro line is that it is cloth, so everyone's falling. Ooh, ooh be careful. Uh-oh. This guy is stiff in here. Okay, hold on a second. You can't just go, you can't just go really willy-nilly hot and fast with your NECA toys. You got to be very careful. Ooh, this shoulder is so tight. Ah, oh my God. Okay, I, I think I'm going to go try to heat this up a little bit. Hold on, I'll be back, guys. Ooh. All right, so what I did was I popped his head off and I popped his hands out. He has gloved hands and he also, the Clark, comes with regular hands. So I think this works great. Now, you can get two looks out of this. He has a, a little bit brighter red shirt with the lab coat from the beginning of the movie. And then he has a darker red flannel um, in, later on in the movie with a members only jacket which I know a Mego figure that comes with a members only jacket that I'm going to be buying and I think it'll complete the look and I will I'm just gonna hand paint with a marker uh, like some yellow stripes on it to make this shirt a cardigan I mean to make it a flannel excuse me I'm thinking of the cardigan okay guys edit to the video now I was doing this video and I recorded it and I didn't think it would be here in time before I could post it and it showed up so we are going to be putting this Stan Lee jacket. This is like a members only 80s, you know, members only jacket basically. And we are going to be putting this onto this figure and then basically completing our Halloween 3 Tom Atkins. So let's do a mini toy review. We're going to do a mini toy review in this video. So let's do it. So this is the Mego Stan Lee figure. And I have to say, guys, I know this is my trigger, you guys. I don't like Stan Lee. I don't have any like love for him like like so many Marvel fans like cry about Stan Lee and like they love him so much. I don't care about him at all. I'm sorry. You know, I not saying like you, know, you you rest in peace and all that stuff, but I don't have like that that cry love for Stan Lee that everyone else has. So, I have to say it's it's a nice representation. I believe this is like supposed to be younger Stan Lee, so probably from the 90s. Uh Stan Lee you got the Mego stuff, you know how they can do. I always think of Robot Chicken when I think of Mego and he's like, Hey, 
Hey kids, how you doing? It's Stan Lee and uh, buy my comics. Okay, so there you go. Nice toy review. I don't care about this. So let's get, let's let's see how this jacket looks. I'm hoping it's going to be oh, this stupid figure. It, I had a problem with the, the body before. Oh, that's it. Guys, this is it. I have a Halloween 3. Ooh, 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 don't. In the earlier this video, like weeks, it was like a week earlier when I filmed the front part of this video and his body was like a little uh, hard. <laughs> it was like, um, what was it? It was just like I had to heat up the body so I could move the arms around and I feel like I need to do that again. This is not good. You know, NECA's quality control is all over the damn place, but I'm not trying to break these figures. They're not cheap. And then look, and it's perfect. He has that, just the bottom in the movie. He puts like just the bottom. He has just the bottom like closed. And look at that. This is Halloween 3, Tom Atkins figure. Perfect. And now I'm going to make some paper cloth accessories. Like I'm going to, like I'll give him this mask because he had that in the, this is the mask that they, when they capture him, they put this on him to, hold on, let's see. These figures are very hard to uh, pose. Oh, I guess now I can recreate that end scene where he's like, turn it off, turn it off. Cause they're in that gas station and he's calling up the, uh, like you could do a little. Oh, I love it. I love it. I am so happy now. That's it, we're good. You know, Halloween 3 was one of my favorite movies. We finally, I have the complete figure. So now, to, just to go over the recipe one more time for anyone who's gonna wanna try this, um, you're gonna have to get the Knight of the Creeps head, head cast. I have the head casts on my Instagram, at Rocco the Great or at the Toy Bookie, just DM me. I only have a few, so if you're interested, you'll have to paint it, I don't paint for people. Um, but I'll have those head casts. Then this is the Mego Stan Lee jacket. It looks better than I thought it was gonna and then the Clark Griswold body. And that's pretty much it, and you have a Halloween 3. Um, you have your Halloween 3 Tom Atkins uh, to go nicely. I'm gonna make a whole little shelf. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna make head casts of those masks, and I'm gonna make like a whole shelf of a silver shamrock, like a mask shelf. I wanna make a whole diorama with the boxes, with the little silver shamrock logos. I wanna make a whole Halloween 3 like big diorama. I might just do it for next Halloween just because uh, Halloween stuff always does better obviously around Halloween time. You know in the middle of the summer people like even when I post this video people are probably not gonna be digging it but I will be digging it and uh, maybe I'll just repost it during Halloween time. It's my YouTube channel I could do whatever I want. So that's it guys make sure you leave in comments down below do you think this turned out good are you gonna do something similar you're gonna copy the recipe um, and I don't mean copy, like are you going to use the recipe and make one yourself? I hate when people go, you copied my custom. It's like, bro, we're all in the, you know, do what you want. Who cares? It's all, we're all in this, this uh, silly hobby together, playing with the children's toys. Um, I am super happy. This is perfect. Now, I, that, that's it. I'm done. And it would be really cool if we get like a custom uh, for that girl from... Uh, I forgot, I'm blanking on their names because I watch the movie so much where I don't care. I don't care about people's names in movies. I, I, this happens all the time. People like to roast me in my videos because like, I, I love the Lord of the Rings and I, I know Frodo. Like, I don't know anyone's name and I don't care. I don't care. I just watch things because I like them, not because I'm trying to test my geek cred. Yo, man, I got geek cred. I'm a cool nerd. No, I, that's not me. Um, stay great, guys. I'm out of here. Leave comments down below. Hit that like button, and I'm out of here. I could just stare at this all day, and I will. Bye, guys. Okay. Okay. Cool. So we actually... Today, we're finding stuff. Wow. Oh, what's this? Anything here? No. Look at this. Ghostbusters.